Growing up, the Gerber family belonged to St. Louis Parish, and much of life was centered on the church and school. And all the children in the area, for several miles around, came to the school. And there were like four in my class, two boys and two girls. And the other boy was actually the classmate who had designs on becoming a priest. The, the other boy in my class had a little altar at his home, and he had a little chalice and all of this, and little vestments that his mom had made for him. And I would go serve him and after school in his home. And he would try to rehash the sermon from on Sunday. And I said, I don't know what I want to be, but I know I don't want to be a priest. Of course, God would have other plans for him. Still, his family may have had an inkling that a unique path was in for Bishop Gerber's future even before he did. I could see at a young age here, there was just something very special about him. He was different, but not that there's anything wrong with the other two boys. Discerning that difference took a while. He's not sure why, but he said God somehow got him to a high school seminary. He stayed about a year and a half before dropping out and transferring to Kingman High School, where he met a girl. That relationship remained a pull for several years, even when he returned to the college seminary. And after the second year, I told my spiritual director, I didn't think I wanted to come back because I wanted to marry this girl. And she said, he said, short of getting married, you make sure you come back because this is where you belong. So at the, I dropped out for two years in Wichita State University, major in accounting, minor in economics, worked for Southwest National Bank. And our relationship with this girl grew closer and closer and we were beginning to get married, look towards marriage the following May, uh, even though we had no formal engagement. And uh, the Lord hit me between the head with like a mallet. And he said what a farmer would understand, he who puts his hand to the plow and turns back is not worthy of me. And I knew I could not turn back anymore. It was that strong a grace. We, we broke up that relationship and it was really hard emotionally because we, we loved each other. And, but I'm glad that God proved to be the stronger and obviously my, my life would have turned out a lot different and I missed God's will for me. Bishop's discernment for his vocation to the priesthood was a personal struggle, but following God's prompting made all the difference. That path has been highly blessed and greatly graced. Mm -hmm.